Uh huh. Someone dilly dally, not wanting to make a decision, making you feel like a little bit uncertain with regards to the relationship, and you're getting tired and exhausted about this because they keep changing their mind. You did try to pressure them already and told them that, listen, this is it. We can't be, you know, like, can't be like friends with benefits or you can't just keep coming to me when you need me. I ain't your mama. Person got hurt and insulted by you and then stand tall and then told you all. So they say, listen, I was there for you when you needed me. So why are you coming up with me with that attitude? Fire sign, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. This is your element reading. So if you're a fire sign, this reading might be for you. Don't get upset. And it's like, oh, I want my own reading. This is something I used to do in the past. So don't worry. Those are still there. You still get your zodiac reading. This is something that I just do on a whim. You got me. Okay. So don't get frustrated. Okay. Hangman, Two of Pentacles, and the King of Cups. So this is the part, fire sign. Okay. Hangman, Two of Coins, and the King of Cups. Mm -hmm. You know what this is? You see the hangman right there? Your person, or in you, has been on this stage of like, I have to say it, a situationship. What is a situationship when it's not a relationship, but you guys are emotionally entangled. You guys are involved with each other, but it's not official. You guys act like you guys are together, but it's not. They do whatever they want and you can do whatever you want, but you feel tied to them. Hence, the hangman. The hangman is a traitor in, the, in a traditional tarot. And normally, it is a card where there's nine coins coming out because that's been stolen. So it's that's why they hang, you know, the hangman. But the hangman now, basically, in modern times, it's more for me. The nine of pentacles is a delay in the past nine months. Hopefully, nine, nine weeks or nine days, not nine months. But you can be with this person for a longer period. Hopefully, not nine years. Because why? Two of pentacles... They don't know. They're not sure. You know, this is the juggler, right? They're too busy. Yeah. They normally, you know, like they say, like this is a juggling of two people. But for me, I always see it as a pentacle. So ne they never really give this relationship the time of day or the priorities. It's like, you know what? I'm going to focus building something with you. They gave you the pentacle, the ace of pentacles. But as soon as you grab that, you guys started dating, they became more involved with other things. And what are those other things that is important to them? Normally it's career, normally it's their business, normally it's anything, okay? Anything <laughs> that is not related to the ace of pentacles that they gave you. So then you would feel like I was led on. Not love bomb though. This is not ace of cups. Or this is not about the two of cups. So this is more of like you promise something tangible in the future and yet you're not committing to me. And look at this person. They have the... One second, guys. Okay. They have the king of cups. Now, the king of cups over here, this is showing, of course, that there is this whole... Well, I can if I can just jump to the... To, you may be connecting with the water sign. I just finished the water sign reading. King and Queen of Cups. You may be connecting with your person, meaning your masculine and your feminine. So there is that energy between the two of you. And this is where it gets frustrating. Because in the paper, you guys look to get, look good together. In the photos, in the picture, you guys look good together. But deep inside you, you know that the Three of Swords is what you're feeling. Mm-hmm. The card of separation, the card of breakup. So you're feeling right now emotionally burdened by this person. Three of swords and the moon card. Judgment is here. You did say what you want and you mean what you say. But what did they respond to it? Nine of wands. They claim that they are hurt by your actions. So you get the blame over here. You get the, you get the bad rep with the nine of wands. You know that I'm not ready. I told you that I had things that I have to deal with. This is not easy for me. I'm doing this. I'm doing that. Nine of wands with a strength card. Your person became this bold person to express their feeling of suffering, their vulnerability. And of course, for you, it's like, oh, they were vulnerable. They showed their weakness. You know, it's like, well, you know, I do love them, you know. Strength with the Nine of Wands. So their vulnerability is something that probably you find very attractive. You have the um, the Knight of Cups with the Empress. Quite a charming individual that you're dealing with. Okay? Knight and an Empress. And then you have the Sun over here. So they know. They know how to make this. 
um, how to say this, how to calm you down. They know how to win you. With the Sun card over here with the Queen of Cups, they do give you some sort of positive news with the Sun card. Okay. So, um, it feels like this is more, because I, I was connecting with this before I, read, before I went to, with the reading, guys. You have, you probably feel like this is what I call a high connection. When I say high, because people look, use a soulmate, this and that, fine. Take that. I like this, oh, it's a high level connection. When I say high level, you know that there is something good. You know, this is a mature individual. We're not looking at a, a man child or woman child, whatever you want to call it. So there's high. This person has done something good in their own life. They're not totally toxic, but it just won't get together. Okay. Then I created, of course, um, today, okay, just for today, we ha I have this, uh, it's called the Supreme Collection. So our highest supreme collection, I put together certain crystals um, together, and I make it this myself, handmade, um, for people who's connecting in this vibe, okay? And just for today, uh, let me see. Yes, yeah, okay, we can do that today, I think. Um, you, If you get any of, in the part of the collection, the supreme collection, you get the second one, or the lowest ticketed price, half off. So buy one, get half for the next one, okay? Half price, okay. My favorite, which is also the top selling one, is the highest protection. One thing with the highest protection is I like this to say I give it to someone because it is an extension of you. So it think of it like Harry Potter. The mom gave the protection and not no no nothing can, you know, kiss me out of love, right? So it's a protection for you and for the person. I would love, you know, people who are in this kind of connection, who's manifesting a soulmate. You know, you give them that. Extend yourself to them, you know. King and Queen of Cups to the Sun card. Now, I don't know if they believe in crystals or stuff like that. You know, that's a different story. But let's just say mom and daughter, you know, like this one. Let me make this one. Okay. So this is gold, real gold, and obsidian or black tourmaline. Okay. For, for this bracelet. It's stretch, guys. So you can check it out. It's in the description. Only today. Okay. Let's see this. Then let's continue. Let's dive deeper. Okay, let's see the oracle. Everybody loves the highest protection more than even the luck. I do. I protect the people that I love, you know. So, and check it out. Okay. Ooh. You feel like I told you? Oh no, I think that's a water sign. That you, you're either you're wasting time. Okay, because this is that or the time is ticking. I don't know if you have a biological clock also that you're saying. I want a relationship. You know, babies and kids is something that I see myself in the future. Ah, uh, the dilly dally. Mm hmm Look at that. Eh, go with the flow. Well, for you, you're so focused, not fixated. Fixated is probably obsessive. Focus on the time. Listen. Two of Pentacles. Hangman. Fire sign. Iris, Leo, Sagittarius. You're telling your person here that how long? You know, it's okay. I'll compromise. But... We can't be waiting for forever, okay? Even JLo said, waiting for tonight. <laughs> Let me use my own tarot deck over here. <laughs> but I, I believe this is out of stock already. Devil card, the shackles between the two people. Okay. Mm -hmm. The sun is a giver of positive news. Judgment is that you did clear the air. You have sun and moon over here, which only means that the eclipse has happened on the 20th, and then the 5th is the lunar, and the next three months, there will be a big change if it's connected to the eclipse. Next 30 days, please. Alrighty. Okay. Oh, there we go. Um, this is your best course of action. Okay. Your foreseeable future with your person. Okay. Let's continue. Sorry about that. Decided to scratch my back. Page of Swords, what are you discovering? Ooh, magician. You're manifesting through the moon with the world card. It feels like you're doing everything to convince your person. Magician, the Page of Swords, and the world. Something that you're putting on the table. So you won't give up. You're not, well, you're a fire sign, so when does a fire sign ever give up anywhere? You see it, you want it, you got it. You know, you do like the passion chase. Let's admit that, okay? Mm hmm The world is here. Judgment, the world card. You do like to chase, but you also know your limit. Mm -hmm. 
You got a nine of cups. Dilly dally. The fool. Look at your person. How young is this energy wise? Yeah, uh, maybe age. Look at that. These are, this is Oracle. This is Tarot. Mm -hmm. So it does show that your person is in the more like, well, let's see. You know, maybe. Not sure. It can be long distance relationship. So they haven't landed yet. They don't know yet. Six of swords. Mm -hmm. You guys are on the same boat, but different destination. And the thing is, you don't know where it's going. Same boat. It's like, oh, so where are we going? I don't know. I'm just sailing here. Isn't it like we're just dating? We're just talking, right? You know, like, isn't it? This is our situation right now. Okay, but dating, how long? I mean, like, I'm not rushing anything here. I know I'm a fire sign and I'm going to be getting the bad rep of like, I'm rushing you and I don't want you to have that image. But communication wise, how about we talk? This is what you're telling your person here. Like, give me some sort of sign. Mm hmm. Because Ace of Base has a better sign. I saw the sign. And that's when, you know, a fire sign would really say, listen, judgment time over here. You need to make a decision. So you ask your person or you're about to. And let's see the magician. What can you do if you're trying to bring in this connection? Okay. Now in the bracelet, guys, it's in the description box. You got different kinds of manifestation there. Protection, love, luck. Um, I forgot the others, you know, but there's five. Of course, there's romance. And there, I believe there's one that is soulmate. Okay. The sun over here, your person is about to give you a news with the sun, which is positive. Now, the strength and the empress over here. Your person does understand. It can be biological clock. I don't know. Some people, of course, it doesn't mean like they want to have a baby. But when I say biological clock, it may not even be biological, like, you know, you want to have a baby. For you, it's just like, well, I'm ready for someone who's a serious person because I'm ready. I'm an empress already. You know, I, wa I want to be with someone who's an emperor. When are you going to step up? And if you are going to step up, let's see the card of focus. Okay. Because remember, your per <laughs> what's the term? A playboy. Now like that. Or is that even a term now? I don't know. Um, what, what do people call the, you know, like... I don't think they call it um, uh, scrub. A scrub is a guy that thinks it's fine. Also known as a buster. Always thinking of what he wants and sits on his. No pigeon, right? And the other. Well, your card of focus is to work it. Okay. Sorry about my face. Don't mind that. Three of cups. You're focusing on working it. Three of cups is a reunion, a celebration. Everything is going to be there, you know, harvest time. So you're not one of those who give up. You're one of those who pursues. And Three of Cups is like, let's see. Meaning, let's see each other. How about, you know, there's so much good, is what you're saying in this relationship, that you do enjoy and you're sticking around with the hangman. Well, let's find out. Link in the description box below for extended reading. No judgment here.